Hey, our friends, today we're going to draw another important person from history. Who are we drawing? Ruby Bridges. Yes, we hope you're going to follow along with us. You need your drawing supplies. We're going to use markers, some paper, and... Something to color with. Yeah. All right, let's start. We're using permanent markers to draw with, but you don't have to. You could use a pencil, or you could use even a washable marker or crayon. Let's first start by drawing her mouth. And let's draw her happy. We're going to draw a little smile in the middle of our paper. And then we can also draw her eyes. We're drawing a cartoon version. I'm going to draw one circle on the left. And then we could draw the same size circle over here on the right. Next, let's draw a smaller oval in the top left for a little highlight in her eyes to make them look shiny. And then let's color in the big circle, but leave that little circle white. Now, anytime that we fast forward the video or if we go too fast and you need extra time, what can our friends do? Pause the video. Yes. Let's also give her eyelashes. I'm going to draw three little curves coming out of her eyes. Now let's draw the shape of her head. We're going to start here next to her eye, and we're going to draw a U-shape that comes under her eye, across for her chin, and then curve back up for her other cheek over here on the right. Nice. Now let's draw her hair. We're going to start up here, and we're, let's add a little point right above her mouth, right in the middle of her head. Yeah, that's a guide point. And then we're going to draw, we can draw a little curvy, little bumpy line that comes out to the left, and we can do the same thing over here on the right. Next, let's draw her ears. We're going to draw the letter C on the left side, and a backward C over here on the right side. Now let's draw the top of her head, and we're going to draw a curvy kind of bumpy line, just like we did for the bottom of her hair. This time, we're going to draw a upside down U shape. And come all the way over to the other side like that. Oh, that's a cute head. <laughs> so cute. I love your drawing so much. Thank you. Let's also draw a bow in her hair. We can draw an upside down U. And then we can draw two diagonal lines coming out of that U. Oh, that's really cute. And then we're going to draw a line coming down and connecting back into her head. Let's also give her a cute braid coming out to the side. So let's draw a U shape. And then we can also draw another U shape or kind of an oval shape. And we're going to draw it curving up. And then we can draw another one. Maybe this one's a little smaller. Then let's draw the end of her braid. We're going to draw an S line. We'll curve one direction and then back the other way. Yeah, and then start at the top and we're going to curve back down and connect. Perfect. What should we draw next? Her body. Yeah, let's do it. We're going to draw two lines coming down from her chin about that far. Then let's draw a U right underneath her chin for her neck. And then we can draw two more U shapes like this for her collar on her dress. Then let's also give her a little bow on her neck. We're going to draw a little rain, two raindrop shapes right in the middle. <laughs> or two, yeah, there you go. Then we can draw the rest of her dress. We're going to come down like this, and then we're going to come back up. It looks like a big letter V. On each side of her body, we can extend these lines down so they match the bottom of the little V. There you go. And then down here at the bottom, let's draw two lines across. I'm going to draw the two sides down a little further and draw another line for her waist. Now let's draw the rest of her dress. We're going to draw two diagonal lines coming out further. And then we can draw a little wavy line to connect those two lines together. Now let's draw her legs. We're going to draw two lines coming down from her dress. 
There you go. And we can draw two more lines, one on each side. This is for the outside of our legs. Then we're gonna connect this inside line to the outside line with the letter U. That's for the bottom of our shoe. And then we can do the same thing on the right side. Another letter U. And now let's draw the top of our shoes. We're gonna draw a line across on each leg. And we can draw a really small U shape inside for the rest of her shoe. Now let's give her a sweater. We'll start up here and we're gonna draw a line right next to her body on each side. Now we're gonna draw her arms and we can draw a diagonal line and it comes out further. And we can do the same thing on the right side. Then connect that line back into her sweater on each side. Let's also add another line for maybe that's the end of her sweater on each side. And then we can also draw her hand. Let's just draw a little U shape at the bottom of each sleeve. Or we could also give her a little bag. Let's draw a rectangle shape. So we'll draw a line that comes out. And we can draw a line that comes back down. And then draw another line that comes in underneath her dress. And then you can connect it back up to her dress. Oh, that's cute. And then we can also draw the handle. So connect a line from the rectangle to her hand. And then maybe another line on the other side. We did it, Mrs. Habs. We finished drawing Ruby Bridges. Yep, but we still need to color her. Yeah, this part we're going to fast forward, but at the end, you can pause the video to match our same coloring. You ready to fast forward? Yeah. Mrs. Hubs, give me five. We did it. We finished coloring Ruby. I love your drawing so much. Thank you. What do we use to color our drawings? Our markers. Yes, we use our biannual markers. If you have the same set, we use these four colors. The skin tone that we use is Y529, and her hair color we use is Y648. And we also use this light blue, B003, and red for her bag is R126. But you could use crayons or oil pastels or even watercolors. Oh yeah, that would be so cool. You could also add a background. Maybe she's walking into her school. If you haven't heard the story of Ruby Bridges, you gotta check it out. Yeah, she's super brave. We love drawing with you guys, and we'll see you later, our friends. Goodbye. Goodbye.